predecessors and successors allow tasks to be rescheduled all at once through the intelligent scheduling engine in Project Insight. A predecessor task is a task that happens prior to the current task. To view predecessors, the easiest way to see your predecessors is to go to the Gantt chart and you can see that gather requirements happens, then perform planning happens, then develop product happens. If we adjust the dates of gather requirements, the rest of the tasks shift automatically. So I'm going to show you now how to set up your predecessors. One of the ways to do this is to add a task here. We'll say we're going to do testing at the end of developing product. You can simply click the add predecessors, then select the task that you would like to have preceding your current task. You can also set lead and lag time between these tasks. The default is to have them finish to start, meaning that the developed product finishes, then this task starts. There's other types as well where they finish at the same time, start at the same time. Click OK. You can say the testing is going to take five days, eight hours, save it off, and the system automatically calculates those dates. You can come to the Gantt chart and you can see that this task happens after that. You can also uh, add another task on the Gantt chart and you can see the task here I want to make the duration a little bit longer and I'd like this task to happen after testing and then automatically by dragging from this bar to that bar the predecessors created the task list also shows these dates in sequence the predecessors here at any time you can just click on it to see what the predecessors are you can have more than one predecessor on a task as well.